A solid cube of side 12 cm is cut into 8 cubes of equal volumes. What will be the side of each new cube? Also find the ratio between their surface areas. So here I have a cube. All the sides are equal. All these sides are equal because it is a cube. And each of this side is 12 cm. So I have here side of this cube equal to 12 centimeters. Now this cube is now cut into 8 cubes, 8 smaller cubes, that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 cubes, fine, which means the volume of this cube, of this large cube, the volume of this large cube will be equal to 8 such volumes. Let's find the volume of this cube. We know the side is 12 cube, so the volume will be S cube. That is 12 into 12 into 12. Now here they have not, in the next smaller cubes, they have not given us the side of the cube. They said what will be the side of the new cube. So this side here is x, this is x, and this is x. So each of them have a side x. This also has got side x, side x, side x. All of them have got side x. So volume of one small cube, of one small cube, equal to x cube, side into side into side. In this case, the side is x. Now what is the equation we can make here? In this we know that volume of big cube, the big cube is cut into 8 small cubes. So volume of big cube equal to volume of 8, 8 volume of small cubes. Because this entire thing here, this here, is cut into these smaller cubes. This one, then this one, eight cubes. So the volume of the big cube equal to volume of eight cubes. The volume of this big cube we know is 12 into 12 into 12. And eight, because, because there are eight cubes, there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 8 cubes and the volume of each of them is x cube. So we need to find the x. So we have 12 into 12 into 12 over 8 equal to x cube. And when you work this out, you'll get x cube equal to 216. And 216 is 6 cubes. 6 cube. So you'll get x equal to 6. So each of this side here is 6 centimeters, here 6 centimeters, and so on, 6 centimeters in each case. Now we have the second part of the question. The second part of the question says, find the ratio between their surfaces. So we have to find the ratio between the surface of this over the surface of this small one. This ratio we need to find. Now we know the ratio of the surface of a cube, of the larger cube, will be 6 s square and that of the smaller cube will be 6 the small s square. So we go further and we say this is 6, your s here is 12, here 12, so it is 12 into 12. And in this second case, the S is 6. Here, yeah, 6. We calculated 6 into 6. This is surface area 1 over surface area 2. Surface area of the blue one over surface area of each of this green one. And then when you cancel and you reduce it further, the answer comes 4 over 1.